Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Top 10 Countdown. I'm your host, Jordan Ross. In honor of the 4th of July, we're breaking down the top 10 most patriotic movies of all time. Number 10 is definitely the oldest film on our list. Yankee Doodle Dandy came out in 1942, and it follows the true story of the patriotic showman George M. Cohen. This movie is filled with musical numbers featuring patriotic songs like You're a Grand Old Flag and, of course, Yankee Doodle Dandy. James Cagney plays a flag-waving, toe-tapping Cohen and won the only Oscar of his career for this performance. I'm a real-life Yankee Doodle, made my name and fame and boodle just as Mr. Doodle did by riding on a pony. Next up is a film that doesn't seem patriotic at first glance, but the more you think about it, the more patriotic it becomes. Forrest Gump follows the story of a mentally disabled man who happens to be present at some of the most iconic events in our country's history. On top of that, he becomes a star football player, a war hero, and he builds his own company and becomes a multi-millionaire. He was also invited to the White House on three separate occasions, meeting three different presidents, he beat the Chinese to become a world champion ping pong player, and he was taught to dance by Elvis himself. You don't get much more American than that. That's all I have to say. About that. Number eight on our list is Patton, the best picture winner that follows the true life story of the famous World War II tank commander. This movie is two hours and 52 minutes of pure patriotism. It even features one of the most patriotic images in film history, a general giving a rousing speech to the masses while standing in front of an enormous American flag. Americans love a winner. While number eight is about one of the most iconic generals in our country's history, number seven follows one of our most iconic presidents. Steven Spielberg's Lincoln focuses on Abraham Lincoln's fight to emancipate the slaves, a movie made by one of our greatest directors about one of our greatest presidents doing one of the greatest acts in the history of our great country. Now that's what I call patriotic. That's right, another Tom Hanks film makes the list. Apollo 13 is a nod to the days when the Americans and the Russians were fighting for the lead in the space race. This film focuses on the crew of the Apollo 13 mission as they fight to survive after just about everything goes wrong. Hey, we've got a problem here. This movie highlights the resilience and courage of Americans and also has some undertones of the rivalry with the Soviet Union, which is a common theme in patriotic movies. Speaking of the U.S. beating the Russians, 2004's Miracle is about just that. However, instead of beating them in the space race, the Americans in this movie beat the Russians in the hockey rink. This is the true story of the 1980 Olympics, when the U.S. hockey team beat the heavily favored Soviets. Sports Illustrated dubbed the Miracle on Ice the top sports moment of the 20th century. Also, it wouldn't be a good sports movie without a great coach to give some inspiring speeches. Kurt Russell does not disappoint. I'm sick and tired of hearing about what a great hockey team the Soviets have. Screw them. This is your time. Number four is a movie that's about arguably the most patriotic fictional character of all time. Captain America the First Avenger is about a skinny kid from New York who's made into a super soldier to help defeat the Nazis and eventually become the leader of the Avengers, a superhero team made up of Earth's mightiest heroes. This movie even features a scene with Captain America punching Hitler in the face. That's pretty darn patriotic. <laughs> Most action films that feature the president in a prominent role involve him being kidnapped and the hero having to save him. Not Air Force One. This film, unlike movies like White House Down and Olympus Has Fallen, has one of the toughest presidents in movie history. Harrison Ford's president, James Marshall, doesn't need Gerard Butler or Channing Tatum to save him. He saves himself by going through his plane and taking out the terrorists one by one. What do you expect if you hijack the president's plane when the president just so happens to be Han Solo and Indiana Jones? Get off my plane. Number two might be the cheesiest movie on our list, but that's what makes it so great. Rocky IV returns to the America Beats Russia theme of our list. Rocky Balboa, one of the most iconic characters ever, decides to take on the man who killed his best friend on his home turf in Soviet Russia. I must break you. Not only does Rocky beat the gigantic Russian, but he gets the massive Soviet crowd to actually cheer for him. 
On top of all of that, this film has eight incredible montages that take up nearly 30 minutes of the movie. Since this entire list is made up of patriotic films in honor of the 4th of July, number one obviously goes to Independence Day. While some other patriotic films on our list have America beating the Soviets or the Nazis, this movie took it up a notch and had America defeating freaking aliens that were trying to take over the world. America figured out how to defeat the aliens with nothing but a 1996 Radio Shack laptop and Cousin Eddie from the Vacation movies. This film also features one of the greatest inspirational speeches of all time, delivered by Bill Pullman as the President of the United States. When the world declared in one voice, we will not go quietly into the night, we will not vanish without a fight, we're going to live on. Well, that's about it. Did we leave off any of your favorite patriotic movies? Let us know in the comments section. Also, be sure to hit subscribe and follow us on all of our social media accounts. Until next time, I'm Jordan Ross, and happy 4th of July.